Greetings everyone, this is Jose, doing another Kickstarter review for you. By just chance, this past week I received the very first Kickstarter project that I backed. Others have come faster, none have been more anticipated than this one, since it was my first one. Now I, I ordered a little bit of a heavier package, I ordered the book, a PDF copy of the book, and then um, I received a couple of little uh, PDFs of the builds to build a um, paladin or a cleric and some and some character sheets for those individual uh, paladins and clerics for each of the gods represented in the book. These are not your core gods, but Baba Yaga, for instance, is one of them that's involved. And so uh, a couple of others that might resonate across many people across the world, including those of us, uh, or those of you, who I should say, uh, hail from the Hawaiian Islands. Now, let me go ahead and introduce you to what I received. Let me show you the book itself. This is the book. It is beyond beautiful. It is 5th edition compatible, and it does make an excellent addition to any of your 5th edition uh, rule books or core books or just plain uh, extras that you have your campaign settings and the like because it does give you more gods than just the standard gods that are in the back and it gives you more story more in depth three to four pages per god let me switch over to the pdf real quick there we go here's the pdf same cover magnificent gorgeous i don't know how well this will render uh, that's the inside cover As you can see, Baba Yaga is in there. And uh, Freya, Fuji. It's Hawaii. I mean, um, that's uh, Fuji. That's Japan, I believe. There's a lot of different uh, gods in here. And my name is in here somewhere. There it is, right there. Where is it? Hello, 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 hello. Right there. Up there, Jose Suarez. I'm a backer. That's one of the reasons why I wanted to get this book, because I wanted my name in a book. And here we have one of the most magnificent uh, full-page pictures of the gods that you have in this book. This is another reason why I picked it up, because the art in here is phenomenal. Introduction, how to use the book, Anasi the First, which is a, uh, a this is not Loth, obviously, but it is another spider god. And uh, meet Chaotic Neutral, a lot different. Baba Yaga, how many of us have run into her? Well, she's a god in this one, or a demigod. Batrakala. Freja. I love the animal she, that's pulling her little sleigh there. Fuji, now isn't that a magnificent rendering of the volcanic god Fuji? Hikke. Just the artwork alone. I'm not going to stay long. Uh, which which one is this guy? He looks powerful. Initi. God of the sun. A sun god. Okay. Morning god. Ishtar. Wow. Mazu. Uh, that would be the oriental lady. Not the two demons guiding her. I have no idea. Ghani. We'll call her Ghani. Ghani. There. Um, an archer of some kind. Arcane archer. Looks like. Beautiful. Uh, this guy looks like he just loves having a party. Has that, that look of a party animal on his face. Shiva. Wonder if that's an I believe that's an Indian. The country of India, I should say. Techanurt Bog. Oh, well, if you wanted... Something that looks evil and devilish. There you go. You can't beat that. Tengiri. A construct horse riding god with a construct parts of his body. A construct. I haven't seen all of these gods. I just went through the first few. Turan. Oh, seemed a, uh, interesting. Very interesting. Vivian, Lady of the Lake. Oh, I wonder if this is the Excalibur mythos. Queen of Avalon, yeah, that's the Excalibur a mythos. 
and of course all of these uh, other monsters or creatures that can come up in the game for you to play with. Wow. Well, that's the book. I totally love it. And I highly recommend it for all of you um, to pick it up, view it. I'm going to be using two of the gods in this book, I believe, in order to spice up my homebrew game. Uh, that uh, male spider god versus Loth should be an interesting battle counter battle since he is chaotic neutral and she is chaotic evil. They're close enough on the alignment chart, but they're different enough that I'm going to have a blast um, pitting the followers of each against each other and having the rest of the world choose sides. That's what I'm thinking for my uh, for a future uh, addition to the current homebrew game that I'm running at this moment. I highly recommend this. If you see it, buy it. These people, this was a first Kickstarter, and frankly, home run, they seriously knocked it out of the ballpark. Thank you for your time. If you like this, please like, share, subscribe, and thank you for watching this Kickstarter